we start the network by connecting 5 peers. The first one is initialized with a special flag. This flag means that this peer will list anonymously and have no bootstrap nodes to connect. Also, it is important to refrain that in our network, out of all peers can be used as bootstrap nodes. Seeing to register login flow through this peer, it is possible to see that we are checking uh, if the user already exists and other things before creating a new account. Now, peer A will follow peer B. In this way, peer A will receive every timeline message published by B. Now, we disconnect peer A from the network. Soon after peer A logged out, peer B makes a new post. This new post will be received by peer A as soon as it reconnects. When someone follows someone else, they should receive all message from their timeline. In this case, the user who is being followed is offline, so followers of that user will send message to the new follower. This way, peer C can receive message from user A. It is also possible to see user suggestions to the respective menu. The suggest users of C are the ones that follow the same users that C does. Now, peer C publish two new messages. When peer D follows peer C, peer D will receive this message published by C. Looking at the profile of user C, it is also possible to see who follows him and who he follows. By unfollowing user B, it is possible to observe that the timeline message published by B disappear from C timeline. Let's now go back to a case where the user is disconnected and the user we follows publish a new timeline message. As we saw before, the user will receive the missing posts again when we reconnect.